this is the opticians and he couldn't feel his arm. So was that? On, outside the wheel axe coming down here just now, I come across the lights and I seen this thing going over and I didn't realise what it was at first until I looked back. And it was a, a, a big heavy built bloke, you know, like wheelchair, Jet Sever. Jet Sever on the bank outside the wheel axe. Did you help him out? I went back to help, there was a woman that got there and another bloke. And he, he didn't give me his name, he just kept saying, uh, I've been to the opticians and I can't feel my arm. Because he was like, he was in shock, that's what it was. It, the bloody machine had gone over the top of him. I don't know. Big electric wheelchair. Yeah, but he was a big guy, about 23, 25 stone though. And me and this other bloke, I, I, I managed to, let, we just left him, but bloody struggling, man. Mind you, it's, it's one of them things, isn't it? But where I parked the van, I don't think the coppers would have done it for it, would they? Nah, not for helping you. Not for helping somebody. No. Nope. Uh, and he put his arm as well, guys. Yeah, but the guy said that he couldn't feel his arm. He kept saying, I've been to the, he didn't say his name at first, I've been to the opticians and I can't feel my left arm. I, I reckon know. he broke it, would he? Yeah, he could have done. Yeah, because, yeah. The mis what, he, what he couldn't move was because the machine was on top of him. It's what he thinks has gone right over like Titanic. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, that's